Hey guys, this is Mill. Today we're gonna show you my stance one, and this is my fully uh, some modded stance one. I did the modification on the bike uh, on uh, while I rode it, so uh, I just did changes that applies to me. So everybody's different. So I want to say, you know, to each his own. So my my first modification on this bike was a uh, Hope Pro Four, the rear hub. <laughs> And so far, it's been an amazing uh, mod. Uh, there's barely any pedal slips. If you guys are familiar with the Hope Pro 4, it's really good for uh, pedal engagement. So it's really helpful if you're having all that uh, uh, slips on your pedal. So yeah. Next thing I did was, well, my pedal. I did a plastic pedal with no metal. Um, this is probably like 20 bucks on the uh, uh, bike store so I prefer plastic over metal or the metal uh, screwdrivers with a screw on it because I just don't want to have those scars on my knee on my shin actually on my shin so yeah I prefer plastic and then I did a uh, clear seat this is a wider seat uh, this more comfortable very comfortable seat I did that and uh, this cost me probably 20 bucks it was on sale and by the way the whole pro 4 the whole modification cost me about $500 the next thing I did was the Atlas bar it was a an inch and a quarter race and uh, so far it's pretty good I liked it a lot and I really like it changed a little bit of the look of the bike and lastly the spank spike uh 35 millimeter stem that uh well the bar cost me about 70 dollars on amazon and the stem cost me about 50 dollars so yeah so it's a really good upgrade and it really feels different and the bike feels amazing when you ride it downhill uh, i mean this uh bike close to uh uh like a close to a downhill spec but you can ride it trail and stuff so um i really like this bike so that will be my bike guys and i hope you guys like my little introduction of my modification of my bike and yeah this is my stance one 2019 that's all the mods so far that i've done on my bike have a great day guys and stay awesome